Hello everyone and welcome in. Hope everyone is doing well. Positive healing vibes to all the subscribers, the viewers, and the world out there. Today we're looking into Pisces Broken Heart reading for the upcoming energy October to the month of November. In this message, Pisces, we're going to tap right into the energies with the traditional deck. And in this message, we are going to look at what's challenging this between you and your person. What each of you can do to resolve the challenge. Then we're going to dive a little bit deeper into your person's energy here, Pisces. And in this portion of the message, we're going to look into your person's true intentions moving forward. We'll look at what's holding this connection back, where this is all headed in this energy, and any advice, guidance from spirit moving forward. We'll clarify throughout the message as well as pull a few oracle cards at the end. If it's something you guys are interested in, you're more than welcome in joining us. So Pisces, let's see what we can see for you guys for the upcoming energy, October into November. Please and thank you. Most important message here for Pisces spirit. What does Pisces need to see? Pisces. I feel here you and your person are both holding back from this connection. However, Pisces, I feel like you have your wall up, you have your guard up, not letting anybody in, not opening up, not seeing things clearly. Okay. I definitely feel an energy of a wall between you and this person, and I feel like you're the one that that is initiating this wall, this guard. Your person is, is merely reciprocating your energy, Pisces. Their side, we have the wheel with the seven of cups. I feel like even though there's some confusion, this person is getting ready to make a decision here. We're going to clarify all of this energy here in a moment, Pisces. I do feel there is an opportunity to come together. There is an opportunity to heal. But I will say, Pisces, you're going to need to open up to the possibilities. So, to clarify the energies here for you, Pisces. We're going to start with the Nine of Wands, Four of Cups energy. Please keep in mind, guys, that the messages here on YouTube are general. They're not going to resonate every time with every person. It's really about the title. If there's something in the title resonating, there's most likely going to be something in the message you need to hear. For information on energy cleanse kits, extended versions to the readings, how to get entered into the drawing that we do here every month for free personal readings, it's all linked below in the description box. And Pisces, if you like the vibe, how I interpret the cards, you're more than welcome to subscribe to the channel. Everyone's welcome, and it does help to set intentions for future messages. Pisces, I feel like you're trying to control the situation. Now, this could be by actually exerting force over this person forcefully or maybe passive aggressively this is causing a lot of confusion i also feel here pisces there's an energy with this nine of swords of your hands being tied okay of feeling trapped and i feel here pisces a lot of it is up in your head and it's causing you to hold back disengage with this person and I feel like this person is getting ready to walk away. Now, some of you, that's going to be okay. For those of you that this person walks away and they do leave, you it's okay for them to do that. 
Okay, you have to be okay with this. You have to let them. Because I feel here, Pisces, that you are being called within at this time. So let's clarify the star energy with the Seven of Pentacles Emperor. I do feel like there is an energy of needing to heal, needing to go within and gain that internal clarity. And it may, may take this situation ending for you to do so. Okay. This, this person walking away um, may be the straw that broke the camel's back. I do feel here, Pisces, you are the one that's resisting this, this connection, but they're getting ready to walk away because of the confusion. So let's tap a little bit deeper into these person, this person's energy here, Pisces. So Pisces, your person's true intentions moving forward in this energy. If you're finding this message is helpful, resonating with your situation, please give it a thumbs up. All the love and support is very much appreciated. It does help with the growth of the channel, getting the message out there. So thank you guys so much for that. You are all amazing. Your other person's true intentions moving forward here, Pisces, for this upcoming energy. Please and thank you. And most important message here for Pisces. Pisces need to I feel like your part, your person here is starting to make a shift, Pisces, into having their guard up, into having their wall up. I feel here at one point this person was very open to this connection to how this um, came together, but now I feel here, Pisces, that this person is second guessing, questioning this connection. Okay. So what's holding this back for Pisces in this person's spirit? Please and thank you. What is holding this back for Pisces and this person? Mm -hmm. Trying to have too much control. Not enough balance. Not enough reciprocity. Equal give and take. I also feel here, Pisces, that you may, um, there may be a lot of arguments, a lot of fighting between you and this person, a lot of disagreements, seeming like you guys can't get on the same page. And I do feel here it has to do with you trying to exude control over the connection. Okay, so let's look here. Pisces, where this is all headed in this energy. There is a possibility for this to come together. There is. For this to work. Okay. But I do feel like you're going to have to let your guard down. They're going to have to let their guard down. And I feel here, Pisces, this is more you than them that has their wall up. Now, I do feel like this is a person that they do bring stability here to this connection, Pisces. I will stay, say that. This probably isn't a person who sweeps you off your feet and runs off in the middle of the night because they're not showing up with that energy. This person is showing up as a very stable um, the confusion is coming from this wall that's being put up. So you have an opportunity here, Pisces, to have something beautiful here with this person. But I feel like there's going to be a need to come together to clear the confusion, to open up. Okay, so your advice, guidance moving forward here, Pisces, for this upcoming energy, we have the Eight of Staffs, Eight of Coins, and the Four of Staffs. I feel like having a conversation with this person, even just about the uncertainty, OK? 
okay? Just shedding light on that. Like, I am have my wall up because I'm confused or I'm not certain. I don't feel stable in this connection yet. I don't know where this is headed. I don't know if this is going to be long term. That hasn't been discussed. None of that Pisces is coming out here. There's a very real opportunity for you and this person to come together, but you're going to have to let your guard down and open up a little bit with this person. So let's get a soul journey message to sum up your reading. Thank you guys so much for all the love and support, for liking, subscribing, sharing the content. You guys are all amazing. I am going to do an extended version to this reading, Pisces. In the extended version, we're going to take a little bit deeper look into the hidden energies. See what comes out there. We'll see where this is all headed. It's the next steps moving forward in the outcome. If the advice is followed, it's all going down in the extended version. The links are all below. Pisces. Your soul journey message coming out for your reading is blame. I accept responsibility for my well-being. It is so easy to give away the power to transform your life. Certainly, there have been people along your path who've helped shape you into who you are today. But you're solely responsible for your own happiness. The ego can be a fragile thing, and if it comes under fire, the first instinct is to blame an outside force. Victim consciousness weakens the connection that you have to your soul source. This mindset says I don't have the power inside myself to break free because someone else's power is stronger. This is an illusion. When you believe that someone else is responsible for your problems, that belief is the problem. Personal responsibility can empower you to change your reality. Lasting transformation always begins on the inside and works its way out. There's a difference between a reason and an excuse. A reason is valid and unavoidable. An excuse is an attempt to shift the blame. Pisces. Right now I feel here you may be thinking that this person is confused they may be inconsistent they're showing in an in and out behavior but i feel here it's because your wall is up and this person is or at one point was gung-ho about this connection i feel here they still are the reason why they're pulling back is because they sense that you have your wall up so if you want this person to come back into your life you need to open up, Pisces. It's that simple. Your blessing message is, I see clearly. I willingly forgive. I breathe love into my vision and I see with compassion and understanding. My clear insight is reflected in my outer sight. I see clearly. Beautiful, Pisces. Beautiful. So, Pisces. I feel like that's a good solid message coming out. Thank you guys so much for all the love and support. Thank you for liking, subscribing, sharing the content. You guys are all amazing. Again, if you want to get in on the extended version, the links are all below. Otherwise, thank you guys again, and I look forward to seeing your beautiful souls again soon. Namaste. Hello, Pisces. And cross watchers, thank you for continuing to watch here on YouTube in this portion of the message, we tap a little bit deeper into the energies and also look at the astrological signs present. So in this message, Pisces, the astrological signs that we see present here, we have earth energy. We have air energy. Specifically, we have Aries, Sagittarius, Leo. Aquarius, Aries, oh, I said Aries, it doesn't have to necessarily be any of those energies. We also have fixed energy with the wheel, Pisces. I feel here the ball is totally in your court at this time. This person is willing to open up with you. 
they're willing to come back around, but I feel here, Pisces, it's going to take initiation from you first, okay? They're going to want to see, see things happening, action, instead of just words. So it's up to you, Pisces, if you want to come back together with this person, I feel like the first thing that you should probably do is simply say with your words that you are, you have your wall up because A, B, and C. Um, just shedding light on and letting them even know that you're aware that your guard is up and you're trying to work on this. It's going to help them to have a better understanding. Okay. So it's the balls in your court, Pisces. So Thank you guys again for all the love and support, liking, subscribing, sharing the content. You guys are all amazing. Again, if you want to get in on the extended version, links are all below. Otherwise, thank you guys again, and I look forward to seeing your beautiful souls again soon. Namaste.